Alex, how y'all doing? Okay, so today I'm coming at you with something a little bit different. I don't normally, if you've been following me, then you know I don't normally do like what's in my bag or reveals really and stuff like that. Well, today I just had an idea in light of my um, birthday tomorrow, um, and it'll be the last year. This is the last year of my 40s, y'all. I'm going to be 49. Um, I bought two things, and I thought it would just be fun to do like a reveal. One of them is actually going to be like a... Uh, replay reveal because I already got one item earlier this week and I've already worn it and the other one I just got so I just thought it'd be fun to just do a quick reveal okay so I recently discovered a brand of boots by uh, Freebird I don't know if you ever heard of Freebird but I was on Poshmark looking for boots and different things and someone mentioned a brand and I hadn't heard of it so I did some research they're out of Denver Colorado I do not understand how I've never heard of this brand because I have lots of pairs of boots and I've never heard of this brand. But anyway, so the the boots that I got earlier this week, like I said, that I that I'm have been wearing, but I put everything back in the box so I could show you. So first of all, it comes in this box. This is the box that it comes in. Freebird, uh, freebirdstores.com. There are several like actual brick and mortar locations all over the country. But um, anyway, this is the packaging on the outside, okay? I'm doing a review video, or a video. And then when you open up the, the box, the packaging, then you have the actual, this is what it looks like right here, okay? Uh, the boots that I bought are the um, Ramon, the Ramon boots. And you'll see they're kind of, um, they're, well, you'll see. So anyway, uh, packaging. I have to tell you, I love the packaging of Freebird. Like literally, they have, okay, look. So you have this, you have a little handle. So if you want to keep this box cool, if you don't cool, whatever. I'm not really a keep box person, so I don't really care. But look, the packaging of this of these boots are amazing. So you open it up and it has this and it has this little story or whatever at the top. It has this really nice, this isn't like tissue paper. This is, this is like bougie paper, okay? There's tissue paper and then there's like bougie. Um, you can see that it looks like you know, animal skin, and it has, well, this little sticker, this little sticker right here, whenever I first got it, it was actually, it's basically closing the paper, okay, so anyway, I just moved it, so you open it up, check this out, each boot, shoe, boot, whatever, has its own dust bag, okay, so this is, this is it, here, I have to put this down, so each boot comes with its own, and this is, y'all, this this dust bag these these dust bags whatever they are not like um you know what you would get from i don't know i can't even think well i hate to say dooney i hate to like throw dooney and burke, burke under the bus but their dust bags or at least most of them are awful they're just thin crap it's just junk these are so nice look this is like you could have a blanket out of this material okay and then this is all like embroidered see so this is just the, the little cover, and they're not drawstrings, they're just little bags for each boot. Here's the boot. What's up, y'all? Now, I know this style's not for everyone, but I freaking love it. I've always seen a style like this. They remind me of like Harley Davidson boots, blah, 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 but they're shorter, and um, it's kind of a, so the color officially is black, but you can see that it's almost like a washed black. It's not actually, see, how it's like the, it's almost like a black wash. This part's pretty black. And then you have this with this, you know, these studs, silver detail, the zipper. I read the reviews. Some people don't like the fact that the zipper only goes, like you can't get all the way. Look, I don't have big feet and I don't have big ankles. So I don't have any trouble getting my foot in with just, you know, I don't, it doesn't bother me to not have the zipper go all the way down. Um, I was reading that in the reviews and I was kind of like, hey, and then I saw it and I was like, oh. Uh, but anyway, inside, course is you know all leather the raw side these are made in Mexico and um, they are a size 7 I have a like I said I have a I have a small foot and um, in a narrow foot it's just a modest heel this goes on the bottom and I know you can't see it now but see there's like this because I've already worn them like I said free bird right here on the bottom and and yeah they're just amazing they're amazing they're comfortable they're all leather and super swag very well made like I said I don't know how I didn't hear of this brand sooner. Here's the back. Just showing you all the detail. And they do have other colors available too. I forgot how many there are. But all of their shoes and boots, all their boots, are super chunky and just they a lot of them have straps and studs and buckles and they're just really, they're really cool. Um, if that's your if that's your thing. 
Now, the first pair I bought though, and I'm not doing a reveal on the first part, but I just brought them to show you. So, like I said, I have lots of pairs of boots. I'm actually wearing oh, my first boots, pair of boots ever. And I've had these things for over 20 years. And they're just, what are these, Nakonas? I think these are Nakonas. Yeah, these are Nakonas. They've had the bottom replaced. Like, they've had work done on them because I wear the crap out of them. And they're the best. They never hurt my feet. Blah, blah, blah. So that's what I'm wearing today. But sometimes I don't feel like wearing, wearing, I don't feel like wearing, some days I don't feel like wearing a tall shaft boot <clears throat> because I don't have, I have them, I'm wearing these like my, my uh, jeans are tucked in. And so sometimes I don't feel like doing that. And some days I don't feel like wearing my boot cut jeans, right? Like I just want, I wanted a booty, but I wanted a booty that looked like an actual boot. I like the pointed tips. Uh, my husband calls them cockroach crushers. I like that. I like the, the tip of it. So anyway, I found the perfect pair of booties from Freebird. And I actually bought these right before Christmas. And this is them. Okay. Yes. Look, I mean, they're amazing, y'all. And these are black. Again, they're kind of a vintage black. And yeah, you just, they're slip on. And I just wear um, no-show socks. I just wear no-show socks with them. So inside, look at that, Freebird, and you have that detail, that kind of traditional Western detail here on the top of the foot. And again, they are pointed, not as pointed as my my other boot, but, but good enough for me, I like them. And like I said, these are good to wear with skinny jeans if you don't wanna, you know, have the whole tuck out, you know, you just want, basically these, you can wear these with anything, with trousers, with, you know, um, leggings, with whatever, jeggings, Whatever you want. I've literally worn them, and I haven't had them that long, but I have worn them with all the styles of jeans that I wear. And um, they serve every purpose. Because I had this one pair of, um, they're like chunky, what, what do you call them? Um, loafers. They're like chunky loafers. You know, they're just kind of an, not an off-brand, but that circus brand by Sam, I don't know. And they're okay, but um, I, I don't know. I just wanted something with the Western slash kind of like, cool bougie vibe and not a super big heel so anyway this was the first pair and then I started going back my daughter got me a gift card for Christmas and I was like oh snap I know what I'm getting so this is what I got like I said and they came this week and I've already worn them a couple of times but anyway okay so the other item that came today this is another item that I have been wanting for a while and like I said it was kind of a birthday present to myself and I just got it I haven't opened it yet and it's um, in an unmarked box. I'm not going to show the front because it has my address. But I don't want to know y'all crazy fools trying to do something. Uh, just kidding. Kind of. Okay. But anyway, I've been wanting this particular style of jacket for a while. And I just haven't, um, you know, whatever, pulled the trigger on it. Um, I, will, I am going to say it's from Wilson's Leather. And I have a um, attachment slashed allegiance slash fondness to Wilson's leather okay there was a Wilson's leather in the mall in my hometown where I grew up and so I can just I can still remember exactly where it was to this day and I loved going in that store because it smelled good and because I just loved leather and I would just like oh and so my very first Wilson's leather jacket my husband bought for me in the fall of 1999 and I still use it it's still in great condition my oldest daughter, who will be um, 23 in March, she took over it like last couple of years and then returned it because she loved the fact that it was true 90s. Uh, you know, she's one of those that's like completely into the 90s. And anyway, and so, um, and then I have another suede jacket that's Wilson's leather. But this one, and it's, it's nice. I don't wear it that often because it has, I, I don't know, it's just, it's not a special occasion jacket, but it's not really... Well, I guess it could be a daily jacket. Honestly, if it were black, I probably would wear it every day, but it's brown and I don't wear brown that much. Okay, so this is, I literally am just now opening it. Like I said, it's from Wilson's Leather. And it's a style, so I'm kind of combining the two styles. Okay, Wilson's Leather, by the way, they had a big after Christmas sale, which is why I bought it. Are you gonna just call me? What is that? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, my kids are in, I'm in the middle of a friggin' video and they're actually doing that. Sorry. Okay, here we go. Y'all, my kids 
alert me. Find my phone, alert me all the time. Oh. By the way, I bought the men's version. Oh no, I hope it's not too big. I bought the men's version because the women's was sold out in the size that I need. Please don't be too big. I'm gonna be really upset. It's too big. Okay, here we go. I'm sorry. This is this is why I don't really do reveal videos because I don't know how. Oh snap! This is it. It's the Moto. Oh gosh, I do love it. I do love it. Okay, I'm gonna try it on. Please fit, please fit. It is hardy. This is not, y'all, I'm telling you, I love Wilson's leather. Gosh, better be a small. Okay, yeah, so I got a men's small. I normally wear a, a women's medium in jackets, but like I said, because of this sale, they, um, this thing is heavy. Oh my gosh, I wasn't expecting it. So this is definitely not a um, novelty, God damn it, a novelty jacket. Okay, I'm sorry, I get too excited and then I can't, there it goes. So the inside is lined, okay? Wilson's leather on the side, that's what it says on the side. Okay. Um, the hardware on it is not the super shiny silver, like the bright. I chose for kind of the matte, the matte silver. And let's see. <laughs> Are you for real? This, I'm sorry y'all. I know not, I know this style of jacket is not for everyone, but I freaking love it. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, see, and then small. And I love the, the cuffs. The cuffs is what did it for me because some of the cuffs had uh, zippers and I didn't want, I don't know, I didn't want a zipper here. Okay, I liked this. I liked the thick band. It's almost like a bracelet, like a cuff. And then I can obviously do this. Here, let's just bring it over and make it a little bit tighter. There. Okay. <gasps> yes, y'all. I literally, okay. Oh, MG, please zipper work because you know zippers can be funny. There we go. I'm sorry. I am feeling super like bad to the bone. I feel like I need to play. Okay, you know what? I'm going to. I'm gonna do it right now. Ready? I'm gonna do it. Hold on. Okay, here we go. Watch. I should have done this sooner. Okay. Oop. I know you're like, wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? Here we go. This better be the original song. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. <laughs> uh-huh. Yes. Look, y'all. There's the back. It's got the zippers. So that was my boots. Are you serious? Okay. <laughs> I know it's kind of cheesy. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, so now I'm going to have to actually post an outfit of the day. Because this is going to be like a reveal slash outfit of the day um, post. Look, London. Isn't it awesome? Like, this is definitely, this is perfect. So, again, if you're a women's medium, you can always go for it. Well, I don't have to tell you. You can always go for a men's small. But I have to tell you that it is thick. This is definitely... You know, because sometimes you'll see these this style of jackets. This is a moto jacket. Moto for motorcycle. I didn't know that. But anyway, um, sometimes these moto jackets can be, you'll find novelty ones. I call them novelty at, you know, whatever, Macy's or whatever. And they're not, they're just thin. They're just thin pieces of crap that are just really to accent or to accent your outfit. This is a functional daily wear jacket that is super um this is super this is super super badass okay sorry oh she heard me i said it i know i said it okay i said it so anyway thank you for watching um again this was just something for fun i don't normally do this i normally do re or um review slash tours look at the link in the bio in the description of this video and make sure that you're joint that you've joined my tribe i do live sales every week and I have a mobile app. And so if you'll just use that one inclusive link, it will take you to a ton of options. Okay. You can download my mobile app, sign up for text alerts for live sales and all sorts of things. So I hope to see you in one of my upcoming live sales. Okay. Okay.